welcome back, guys. Back to my sleeping dogs. Now I'm gonna, uh, my sleeping dogs playthrough. I'm gonna bail on this car. Not only is it hot, it's wanted by the cops, but it's just a mess. That escape was, uh, yeah, it had its moments. It wasn't, uh, wasn't the greatest. But, um, I think we're gonna go. Middle of the night here. Go do a little uh, of our undercover work. The cover of darkness here. So we'll head to the blue shield to get these cop missions going as well once I find a car. A parking garage right up here. Oh god, I should have just driven. Uh, maybe I'll find a lockbox or something along the way here. You have a car in here? Of course, as soon as I get on foot, it starts raining. At least I'm here. Who oh, parks right at the entrance of a parking garage? Blocking me in. Seriously, I need to make that corner out of that turn? Come on. I do like the fact that they use all the alleyways in these, uh, when you put a waypoint on the map. I do like that. A lot of games won't do that, you know. It'll just, uh, just show you the, use the main roads, right? But, uh, this one, it, it actually does use the alleyways. So, it helps you learn all the little areas, right? And as you can see, that tea we drank way back earlier in the yesterday, right, still has it's still having an effect on us, you know. So it really does. It is long lasting, you know. Worth spending the forty-two bucks for a cup of tea. Make sure nobody's watching me. Don't have a tail going in here. What are you doing here? I'm sure you and Penju have a lot of top-secret backdoor business to attend to. I'm sorry about how I acted in there, you know, just playing the part. I'm already out there on the streets, I hear things like this ketamine racket. I'll see what I can dig up. How's that for an olive branch? Be serious, just like that. It's what I, I do, lady, it's what I do. <laughs> what? I'm just a little shocked. I'm just used to Pendra's people being more like him. I just think we'd be better off helping each other. Come on, what do you say? I could really use the help if you're willing to give in. Well, all right. Oh, I'll give it to you, all right. All right, so what are we doing? We are texting Ming. Oh, Raymond. I hate this guy. He's like the, the Conroy of the cop side. Once he wants me to check up on you, everything cool, so we're going to send that off to him. Now, if you remember, Ming is the guy that we beat up a couple episodes ago. We got into it with him. Meet me at the noodle shop, he says. All right. So basically, what had happened was... Uh, was Ming was working with Winston and Jackie and Conroy, you know, and then he jumped ship, went to work for Dog Eyes. So we went over and, uh, you know, we were sent to uh, to remind him where his loyalties lie, and we did that. Grab this lockbox here. Um, so now he's back with us, but uh, he's, you know, he's he won't go to his normal drug supplier. Um, because he's scared of what dog eyes might do to him, you know. So we're going to meet Wing or Ming, Wing, and uh, and then we're going to probably pick up the drugs for him if I remember right. So let's get rolling.
the hell did I hit? I don't remember hitting anything. Car's all banged up. Mr. Ming, good to see you again. Water under the bridge, man. Water connect? under the bridge. You get everything you need? No, man. I haven't been back to Popstar since I left Dog Eyes. I'm not sure how he's gonna take it. Want me to talk to him? Yeah, yeah. I'm just about out. So grab my next shipment and make sure everything is cool. Why the hell would they take me over here? I had to go to that marker first. Look at my car now. Why couldn't I just leave the way I came in? Just uh, that ma that makes no sense to me. Anyway, it's just up the road though. I probably could have walked had it not been uh, pissing down rain out here. So this here, I guess, is pop star, drug dealer, supplier. Going to get some ketamine off of him. And again, I have to walk hey, over here first. Pop star around. What would a nice looking boy like you want with my boyfriend? What do you think, woman? I'm looking for drugs. I mean, your boyfriend's office is a goddamn soiled couch on a basketball court, roadside basketball court. What do you think I'm here for? You pop star? Who's asking? Look, I work for Winston. Dirty Ming's operating in our territory. I want to make sure he's supplied. Sure, I'll fix him up. But... But what? I gotta get paid. In advance. I'll make it easy for you. A couple of deadbeat junkies owe me money. Guys used to deal for me before they became their own best customer. Collect what they owe me, and I'll hook your man up. You got no problem cracking skulls, Popstar. Sounds like a deal. 48 meters away. <laughs> oh, not. I guess the drugs are really starting to get to these two. They're trying to uh, to avoid Popstar, yet their hiding spot is just around the corner. <laughs> All right, lads. Hey, you old Popstar, some cash as I hear it. Head meat nuts. All right, phone call for you, sir. And you, you look thirsty. Oh, I wanted to put him into that pop machine. Damn it. That's why it fucking hurts. Who the fuck are you? Yeah? Guess son on you will take on anyone these days. Poke guy. Who's that? Hang Shen. Best shit in Hong Kong. You got my money? Got your money. Here's your package. Tell Ming to stick with girls over 14 this time. It's the club. What? I guess that's why they call him Dirty Ming. Christ. Let's go. So to evade arrest, it's just to pop the space bar as it flashes up, you know. <laughs> it is pretty easy to get away from them, but uh, I don't, I have messed it up in the past, you know, just hammering, just hammering on buttons kind of mindlessly and you end up missing it. Ooh, he's right on me here. <clears throat> Out of the way. Come on. If you need to put a little distance between yourself and the cops, just hop over an obstacle. Uh, it, it will slow them down. 
But they will be able to kind of maintain your pace as long as it's just a clear run. I'm gonna hop in here. Oh, shit. Get off the wall, way. That's what I wanted to do. I don't think so. It's not happening. That has to be good. Come on, come on. No. You have money. That's good. All right, give me your chicken on a stick. You're Twenty-five dollars. I got forty grand already. That's not bad. A little boost to health regeneration. You can see it doesn't last quite as long as you know that tea does. That 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 tea bonus that we got. Probably just a few hours. Anyway, I think I have to call Tang back. Let's see here. Inspector Tang. Yeah. What have you found? I got enough to bust Pop Star, but I also met a supplier, a guy named Fang Shen. Find out where he hangs out, and I'll see if I can get something on him. I'll get back to you. So nice little escape route from the cops up in here. Ooh, that dice game. Let me in here, guys. I got 40 grand burning a hole in my pocket. Come on. Ah. I'll find my own game. I'll start my own game. There is gambling on this um, in this game somewhere. I think it's on a boat somewhere. I can't can't quite remember. We'll get to it eventually, though. And foolishly, I have to walk to this stupid checkpoint just to go back and talk to Ming around here. Oh, I lead Oma. Got the stuff, right? Don't worry, I got your stuff right here. Now I can start making money again. I'm gonna hop into the night market here, get some get some shit for the apartment. Ooh, got some upgrades. So here's the cop side of things, so what we have here is starting things off. Uh, Slim Jim. Use the Slim Jim to quickly break into cars without setting off the alarm or breaking the window. That might come in handy, but, uh... Fast disarm, we can disarm gun-wielding enemies without a struggle. I think that's the way to go right now. Just in case, you know. And I do love a good gong. I do love a good gong. That's why it's in the intro. Popstars, uh, connect supplies at Lok Fu Park. Do some surveillance. Alright. Uh, I guess I'll have to wait to go get my uh, my furnishings. And there's actually a hidden guy in the in the night market that will give you a stereo system for your apartment. He's in one of the little side alleys in there, so it's worth finding him as well if you're playing the game and haven't already. If you're if you're interested in stuff like that, you know. But anyway, guys, I think I gotta wrap it up here. Uh, I'm about uh, just kind of scratching at that that 15 minute limit. So guys, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next episode later.